Hi, Crystal LaVamway, the Realtor Gal with Home Smart Real Estate, and I'm here to give you a quick update on what's happening in the Phoenix real estate market. Our March numbers are in, and the news is looking a lot better. Temperatures are on the rise, and so is Phoenix real estate. Uh, activity levels have come up quite a lot. We're about the same level we were in 2005, as buyers are coming in to snap up the good deals. Um, our prices are down overall on the average about 40% from where they were last year. So buyers are recognizing the value, they're coming in and they're getting some awesome deals. Here's the thing though, if you look at our inventory overall about seven to eight months, that includes all the short sales. About two thirds of the homes that are being sold right now are bank owned properties. About 10% are short sales and the rest is everything else. There's not enough inventory though to sustain the level of bank owned properties that are in demand and there's too much inventory of the short sales. A lot of buyers don't want to wait a couple months to hear back from the bank. So the short sale listings are sort of languishing, uh, just sitting on the market waiting for the bank to foreclose on them. Whereas the bank owned properties, some of them are selling in a matter of days. I just put an offer uh, on a house uh, yesterday. Uh, we took Easter off, I guess it was, yeah. We took Easter off, so it was two days from the price drop, and uh, by the time we got our offer in on that second day, there were 18 offers on that property. So there are some great deals, but you've got to be on the ball if you want to snap up the best deals. Um, there's definitely deals to be had, though, so no worries there. What's coming up? Well, the banks have lifted the foreclosure moratoriums, and a lot of the big banks were not doing any foreclosures. They kind of put a, a stop to them for the time being while they waited for the government programs to kick in. Well, those moratoriums are now being lifted. So we expect here in the Valley to see more foreclosure listings, which is, I think, actually good because those are actually selling. So that's going to keep our inventory levels down and hopefully, again, continue to stabilize the prices. Better than a bunch of short sales. Who wants those? So that's kind of what we are looking at ahead. And hopefully what's going to happen overall is we're going to start to see some real, real good signs of recovery here in the Phoenix area. So that's it for now. If you'd like some more information, just visit my website, www.therealtorgal.com. I've got some great statistics and information there for you. You can also check out my blog um, on my website. There's a link to that blog. Uh, you can also give me a call on my cell phone if you have some questions. I can be reached at 480-282-7464. Just give me a call or send me an email at kristen at therealtorgal.com. Thanks for listening. See you next time.